Hey guys, welcome to my Pepper's Ghost uh, Blender render tutorial. Where we'll be making essentially this. Just. Blender. Okay. First, I'm going to switch to Cycles Render. I'm going to turn on screencast and should have did this earlier. Alright. Save it. Whatever. Okay. Delete everything. Switch to front orthographic by pressing numpad 5. Add in a camera. Switch to top view, numpad 7. Move the camera about four grid spaces. Add in a mesh, whatever you want. Add in a monkey. Give it a quick subdivision, subsurf, and smooth shading. Give it a very quick material. We'll make it uh, shiny. Use nodes. Uh, make sure that you have the node regular add-on installed. Be using that. So shift F to switch to glossy. Shift D, duplicate, combine them. Yeah, it's like very glossy. Add in a quick layer weight. Turn on transparent your film settings set to 100% GPU compute let's uh, add in a quick lamp Why? Something like that. Just kind of do whatever you want. I'm going to turn off the camera visibility. Both these lamps right here. Preview. Give this a quick render. It's a bit dark. Uh, oh, yeah, so let's go to world yeah, black. Give these an. Missing shader. Set two. Oh, 
Let's pull. Quick render. Alright, uh, good enough. Alright. Switch back to timeline. Name this front. Then add a new copy settings. Name this right. Switch into right view, numpad three. Add in a camera. Switch to top view. You get about four grid spaces. All right. Uh, add uh, another scene. Copy settings. We'll call this rear. Switch to rear view, control numpad one, or back ortho, add in another camera, numpad seven, move it about four grid spaces, right, add one more, and we'll call this left. To left view, control numpad three, add in another camera, seven, move it four grid spaces, and save. Alright, go back to your front scene, select your objects. Alright, one more thing, let's add in a curve. Circle, scale it up, parent your head to it, follow path. Change the timeline to 100. Should get this effect. Alright, select everything, control L. It's very important. Control L and link it to the left, rear, right. Now you should have different view. Let's see how this looks. All right, that's looking good. All right. So you at the front. All right, now change from default to compositing. Slide this over. Let's add in a viewer node. So, uh, viewer. And select backdrop. Now we want an Alpha over. All right. Plug that like that. Now select this render layer. Shift D to duplicate. Shift D again. All right. Same deal here. Shift D. Box select these guys, B. All right, select this guy, Shift D. These are all alpha overs. Now, plug each image into the image. All right, slide those over. Box select these.
All right. Now add in a distort scale. Need a bunch of those again. All right. Now add in a distort translate. Not transform, but translate. Whole lot of those guys. All right. And one more we'll be needing distort rotate. Oof, there we go. Okay, so front. We'll set this to right. Set this one to left. And this one to rear. Yeah, set this to fit. All right, Let's just render. Oh, by the way, I have auto tile the set on. Highly recommend it. Alright, so I'm going to scale each one of these to 0.3. So just do that. Translate our top one into Y point two five and select relative. Translate, uh, we'll do the rear. Translate the rear in the Y negative point two five relative. And we're going to rotate him 180 degrees. Alright. Now we're going to scale this guy in the X to point, point 0.25. Or translate, sorry. Uh, let's go. Negative point five. Oh, I just select relative. All right, point three. <laughs> relative negative point three. Uh, no, negative point two five. Point two five. All right, should have something that looks like that. I'm actually going to go negative point two on these guys. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Mm. Let's scale up this monkey head just a little bit. You know, fill the frame. All right. Yeah, that's about it. Uh, let's go back to default. Do a quick test.
that looks pretty good. Alright, already animate. Set your output folder. Desktop. Call this shiny. And ready to animate. 